Welcome to the Batteries of the Future report. Sodium alumina solid state or Sir Energy batteries are destined to be the game changing grid battery of the future. So how does this battery work? A Sir Energy battery consists of a ceramic tube with a central positive terminal. The tube is filled with nickel cathode granules and simple table salt before being flooded with sodium alumina chloride medium. The ceramic tube allows sodium ions to transfer, thereby performing the same function as a liquid electrolyte in a lithium ion battery. The ceramic tube is housed in a steel canister, which acts as the negative terminal. As the battery charges, electrons flow from the positive to the negative terminals. Sodium ions from the salt flow through the ceramic tube to the negative terminal, leaving the chloride behind. Chloride ions attach to the nickel, making nickel chloride. During charging, migrating sodium ions form a molten sodium anode layer between the outside of the ceramic tube and the steel canister. The fact that the anode self forms during charging and dissolves during discharge is unique for these Serenergy batteries. And during discharge, electrons flow back to the positive terminal, while sodium ions transfer back through the ceramic tube to the cathode section, joining once again with the chloride and transforming back into salt. The nickel is reduced back to metallic nickel. Now here is the electrochemical reaction of the battery. As you can see from the Serenergy battery chemistry, there's no flammable liquid electrolyte as there is in lithium ion batteries. Instead, a ceramic solid state electrolyte is used. As a result, the battery is totally fire and explosion proof and it's resistant to thermal runaway. Unlike lithium ion batteries, the Serenergy solid state batteries perform in extreme climates from the most freezing landscapes to the desert heat. Serenergy battery lifespan is beyond 15 years. That's almost double that of a lithium ion battery. The materials are cheap and readily available. Serenergy batteries don't contain expensive lithium, but use common salt or sodium ions. They are free of cobalt, graphite and copper, which means manufacturers won't be exposed to critical metal price rises or the supply chain concerns surrounding lithium ion batteries. An Australian listed company has a 75% majority ownership of a joint venture with Fraunhofer IKTS. It's commercialising a 100 megawatt hour Serenergy battery plant in Saxony, Germany. The company is confident that Serenergy batteries will provide the grid storage solution for the future. That is the Batteries of the Future report.